today I'm going to be showing you my August 2014 empties. I usually pair empties and favorites together, but school has started, life's getting crazy, so I'm trying to film a lot of videos at once, and I honestly haven't thought about what I've really been loving throughout August. A lot of it remains the same, like I have been addicted to my Lorac Pro 2 palette, which I think I mentioned last month. I'm loving the same lotions, so I just don't want to get too repetitive with that. I'll just show you my empties for this month and maybe I'll have more favorites for next month. Anyways, let's jump right into it. So the first empty is this 91% alcohol. This is a huge bottle, yes, but this is what I use. Um, it, I'll put it in a mini spray bottle and put it in my professional makeup kit, and this is what I use to spray on brushes and products in between applications, in between, you know, if I have several models. That way everything stays completely clean and ready to go as if it was brand new for the next model. Now, I did not finish this P.S. I Love You fragrance. It was to like here or something. I ended up just pouring it down the drain. I love this product. I love the smell. But if you've watched my fa fragrance videos, you know that I love fragrance. I just don't wear it enough. And so I have too many and they go bad and they're too old. This was just way too old. And it's like old fragrance can make you break out, get, get skin irritations. It's just not worth it. So I ended up getting rid of it. It's one less thing I need. I finished this iced gingerbread anti-back from Bath & Body Works. You know, I've been using a lot of anti-back lately because, you know, again, in between clients, it's always important to sanitize your hands in front of them so they know that you, you're serious and you're not going to get them sick. Um, I've been using it, you know, at the gas station. I don't overuse anti-back, like, on a daily basis I'm not using it, but the gas station and makeup gigs mainly, and so those have been increasing, so I've been using it more. So this was a really good scent. I got this from Eiley, and I really enjoyed it. I finished this Noya lip balm in vanilla. This is a kosher natural lip balm and it smells amazing. Oh my gosh, it was so smooth. This was the lip balm I was using for a while at night. If you guys know me, you know that I apply lip balm religiously every single night. That way my lips stay nice and moisturized and I'm just staying on top of it. So um, this was the one I was using. I got it from an Ipsy Glam Bag, which if I can find the video, like the month that it was in, I'll link it below, but basically it was a really good product. I'm not going to repurchase it just because I have so many lip balms and I love so many that I can just get locally, so to me it's not worth it to order this online, but it was a really good lip balm while it lasted. I finished this travel size of Urban Decay Primer Potion. You guys know this is my holy grail. This is my number one makeup product out of everything, I'd have to say, just because it never fails me throughout sweat, throughout heat, humidity, and just everything. This keeps my makeup lasting all day, and I absolutely love it. I finished this Venice Dolce Berry Shower Gel from Bath & Body Works. Now this was from last year when I did the sale, like buy three, get three free. Um, absolutely love this scent. It didn't come back this year, so. I guess that's it, but it was a really good summer scent last year. <laughs> I finished two of these Dove Go Fresh Revive deodorants. What is it about empties videos? I drop something every single empties video, I swear. Anyways, I have two here because I finished the one that I had at my house and the one that I had at Dylan's house, so, ew. All right, they're like breaking, I should not open them. Um, but anyways, so I just finished both of them, ironically, within the same month, so there you go. So that's the story there. But I love this scent. However, I've really been getting into the secret clinical antiperspirant because for some reason, let's just be honest here, I've been having a bit of an issue with smelling more lately. I don't know if I'm perspiring more. It was summer, but it wasn't like crazy hot like it has been in past summers. So I've been needing something more heavy duty, but this usually works really well for me. I love how this scent actually covers up how you smell. It's like the weirdest thing, but it you still sweat, but then it smells good. I don't know if that makes any sense. Hopefully it does. So again, I did not finish this, but I was about halfway through this China Glaze 4 Audrey Nail Polish. If you guys know me, you know that this is like my number one nail polish, my all-time favorite. If I could only have one nail polish for the rest of my life, it would be this. Um, so basically, it just got really old, separates so quickly and easily. So I went and bought another, replenished it, replaced it, obviously. So I'm just getting rid of this one. My last empty is this L'Oreal Smooth Intense Polishing Shampoo. I still have the conditioner in my tub that I use for um, moisturizing after I shave 
because I like to use the same shampoo and conditioner like religiously together but is it just me or does the shampoo always run out before the conditioner? Uh, anyways, so I couponed this a little while ago and I absolutely loved it. It really did help with my frizz, it made it nice and smooth, and it cleaned really well. So this is definitely a shampoo I would repurchase. I also finished the Suave Keratin Infusion Dry Shampoo. I finish this like every month or every other month because I use this stuff all the time. It's my favorite dry shampoo and it's really affordable. Alright, so that was my empties video for the month of August 2014. I cannot believe how fast this year is going. Now we are in my second to last semester, um, and I just know it's going to fly by, and before we know it, it's going to be Christmas. I mean, that's just insane. It feels like it just started, and so much has happened this year. I feel like the older I get, really, the faster it's going by, and I'm not liking it. Not liking it. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I hope you guys have a great semester if you went back to school as well. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and are having an awesome day, and I will see you in my next one. Bye.